what is going on welcome back to the channel it's your boy blunderbuss 79 and today we're going to be taking pro in her winter ops uniform into abx we're going to be seeing how she stacks up with a heroic uniform with a ctp of judgment in abx and abl against some of the most meta characters out we have fought before rose you know you cannot match my power oh come on give a gal a little credit where we're talking storm we're talking luna snow and full disclosure here we do have a rank five type enhancement no in fact on her we do have a ctp of judgment like i said before with a heroic uniform and she's level 70 gears 25 she does have some odins on her storm on the other hand does have a mighty ctp of judgment she is tier 4 she doesn't have an artifact she is rocking the power of angry hulk iso set with the type 6 enhancement with the striker as my guy warlock right here she also has some odins and then in the case of luna she does have a mighty ctp of rage she also does have her artifact she is rocking the power of angry hulk iso set type 5 enhancement she will be rocking captain america as a striker and no odins or none of that to speak of and uh, just in case i didn't show you she's also rocking the power of angry hulk bet let's go ahead and pop over the alliance battle and get the show on the road uh, we will be rocking luna snow first with the more leadership and fury support let's go ahead and jump in and i did test this a little earlier on my live stream under the first look feel free to go check that out And at first we had Luna with the judgment and Rogue with the rage. And to be honest, I think Rogue performs much, much better with the judgment than she does with the rage. You're able to get a lot more out of the character. I'm gonna skip the four on this rotation. I wanna have it available for the cancel. And I only have 13% Pierce was clocking in about 10 million. But when you're able to see what Rogue is able to do at level 70, you'll see why I say um, he is definitely worth the tier four in the winter ops of a uniform. I think I'm gonna miss the um yeah I think I missed it there we're not gonna start over though we're just gonna keep it pushing because we are still on pace here I think I actually got the cancel that time. But we are definitely running behind what I was able to do on the live stream because of those two cancels right there. Let's 
that definitely put us off. You're as fast as a swamp bug on a hot skillet. <laughs> Let's see if you're as nimble. <laughs> Guess not. Uh, quite a significant amount. Like I said, we were able to uh, do the 10 million in the live stream. But we're going to go ahead and keep it pushing here. And we're going to do the same thing with Rogue. Same team up. At tier 3. Because we all know that Luna is. A DPS monster. And cancel or no cancel. There's no way that a tier 3 level 70. Should be keeping up with. Uh, Luna right. And I will say this, one, it's a lot easier to cancel the roar with Pro. One, because the skill is on the one skill, and then two, um, it hits like immediately. So there's no waiting, there's no wind up or any of that stuff. If you look just from pacing wise, he's able to keep up. And the rotation that I'm using with Rogue is uh, read, delay, cancel until you see that pop. And then I five cancel four really quickly. Now I'll let the four play out a little bit before I go into the six. I'm actually screwing up here because I should be using the one and the two in between a lot more and then I cancel into the six right there because Rogue gets extra time on the damage prop because of her passive you're kind of able to do some wonky stuff with her if you wait until about it's four and a half to five seconds left to go on the prop you can get most of that damage from the tier three in. Like even here, I can just wait until really, really late to cancel. So we're gonna go ahead and cancel that there and then get all of the damage from the tier three. Now I will say this, and you see she's right there 8 million you have to wait for that pop on the um and you see that damage prop go off even in the middle of the tier 3 skill and then the fifth you can use to reposition her with We'll go ahead and hit him with the tier three anyway, because we know we can cancel really late. And she's right there with her, nine million. Now, in uh, my ABX run that I did on the live stream, they were about 500,000 apart. But I will say this, that being said, being 500 to, in this case, 700,000 apart, because I scored about 9.6 um, with the Rage, and I scored about 9.4 with a Judgment with Rogue on the live stream. Um, but yeah, that's, that's really 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 close and then I was scoring I think 9 million with Luna with the Judgment and 10 million with the Rage uh, with Luna and that's Luna with an Enraged um, versus what I was doing with a regular Rage with Rogue okay so in this one we're going to be running uh, Storm with Polaris lead. And then we're gonna switch it out and see how Rogue airs here.
and you do have to do some wonky stuff because you're gonna have to use Polaris to cancel at tier three. You're not gonna have that problem at tier four. For Rogue at least. Um, but you run into the same problem with Storm here as well. Um, she can't cancel without the tier three striker, but you should be running her at tier four anyway. Okay, we were able to pick up that light before it disappeared. We had catch that out of the corner. My eye right there. Okay, if we can get in at least one rotation before he tries to dip. If not, we'll just use the switch with Polaris. does not want me to use my tier 4 skill. Finally. Off rotation. skates on all the damage. So not the best showing. I believe I did like 3.6 million in the live stream. With Storm. there 3.3 okay we're gonna be coming back in here with the same thing Polaris lead um, with Dazzler support and we're gonna see if Rogue can pop off we're all gonna have to be using Dazzler for the cancel of the roar Right. So far, so good. Looks like we got some light down there. Pick that up so we don't lose it. Okay, we should have something on this rotation. Okay, we picked up another light. Then we to tier three. that light nice 
at 2 million with a minute to go. That's the fifth right there. better as well because she has movement off the fifth and uh, movement off the second skill if you get in a jam that's 2.6 on a skate and attack it kind of missed like I said neither run was optimal no. He's clocking in right at 2.9, right at 3 million with uh, tier 3, level 70. Yeah, I would say that the meta is, yeah. And the same thing with, uh, with the Luna Snow comparison. Y'all let me know in the comments what y'all think. Like, comment, share, sub, and uh, let me know if the... Uh, if the ABX meta is um, changing or is it the same? Is it these three ladies as far as the speed, as far as the mutant, as far as the hero is concerned? We'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace.